Hi again, thanks for joining us today. I'm David Thomas, this is Tony Lander. We have Steve Buenza with us from Century 21 Mortgage. We've been talking about an FHA loan, which requires a minimum of how much for a down payment? Uh, three and a half percent. Three and a half percent of the purchase price of the house you can get into a house that we never were able to qualify under FHA years and years ago. Um, there are certain issues or certain uh, minimum condition for properties that qualify it for that FHA loan. What are, what are certain things that um, you look for, or more importantly, the lender looks for when it comes to approving an FHA loan? Well, FHA, they're very health and safety conscious. They want to make sure that the house is livable. They want to make sure that it's in good shape. Uh, if you're looking for a fixer, FHA probably will not be the loan for you because they, they want to make sure that you can basically go in, move right in, live, cook things, have heating, have floors, uh, fixtures, uh, things like that. Wow, that's asking a lot of a house to be able to eat, live, <laughs> have heat, and uh, fixtures to be able to turn on and off the water. You'd be surprised. But, yeah. but if everything worked and the furnace didn't work, there was no heat, you can't say, oh, as a buyer, I'll take care of that, you know, we'll fix that once we move in. No, you can't. That has to be fixed and working before escrow closes. There's a lot of pressure put on appraisers now to actually inspect the property and take pictures of anything they think might not fit within FHA guidelines. So in the case of uh, this photo with the water heater that only has one strap on it, the California requirement, California law says that the seller in California has to make sure for earthquake safety that there are two straps one in the top third, one in the bottom third, tied into the studs. If it is not double strapped, they will require that to be done and re-inspected by the appraiser. We have some pictures here where you can see the carpets have been torn out and there's discoloration along the wall. Um, just from looking at the picture, I mean, that could be misconstrued as being mold or, you know, water damage. We prompt an inspection. And then it's up to us to go and prove that no, it's not mold or provide a reasonable explanation. Over on the east side of Petaluma, there was an Adobe Creek house that um, the oven didn't work. Well, guess what? With an FHA loan, which they were, um, we can't lend money on this house that doesn't have a working oven. A little deferred maintenance, a little out of date is okay. It's just it has to be livable in a functioning, safe house. For Tony Lander and David Thomas from SellThatHouse.net, Century 21 Mortgage Advisor, Steve Gwenza, we appreciate you tuning in. Join us next time for the next bit of info.